All right, check it out, guys. We just got done watching Bad Boys for Life. Yeah, you want to be in it? Let's go. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> and uh, man, it take it takes me back. The first Bad Boys came out in 1995, which is crazy. So this is like 25 years. So yeah, it's it's, it's been is when they were young. They were little babies. Anyways, uh, we we wanna I, I wanna ask everyone what they thought about the movie. I mean, this is a 25 year span, third bad boys. It might not be done, you never know. But let's see what everyone thinks. All right, let's start with Jen. She, this is her favorite thing in the world. All right, one low, 10 high. It was all right. A little nostalgia, okay. A little unexpected. <laughs> it was kind of slow. All right. Okay. Hello, Ryan. What do you think? Solid seven. What was your favorite part? And that's why you want to be a cop. All right. Sis. Oh man. We watched it a lot. Back in time. Kind of like. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Absolutely. Kelly. Okay. Right, right, absolutely. Yeah. Well, Charles Edward Skinner the third. We're all right there in that era. I've watched every single week, right? Especially the second one. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think they could top the second second one. Yeah. Yeah. The second one. I want to go back and watch the second one because I remember that being the best one. For sure. What's that? Oh man, yeah, yeah. That was like the highlight, right? It's like really, and that was like quick that came yeah. in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, good, good. Crystal. Um, I give it a seven. Um, the second one is still my favorite. I was still laughing pretty hard in there, but the second one's still my favorite. I have to say, but it it still leaves room for like the fourth one at the end here. So yeah. Yeah, yeah. Cool. All right. Sweet. And the actual police officer isn't even here. No. <laughs> uh, he gone. He had to mysteriously go to the bathroom. Yeah. But uh, what I would say about this movie, I, I also give it a seven. I think it's worth watching. If you watch the other ones, like when you were a kid, it takes you back in time. Uh, there wasn't quite as much bickering, like as is what I remember in the other ones. It had its, it had its moments for sure. Um, Cu couple things. This movie would have been a lot funnier if I was like in my fifties. You know, I feel like because uh, you got those old man jokes, like like you ain't got it anymore kind of thing. Uh, but I think they had a good cast. I think uh, I think overall, you know, Bad Boy. The, the movies are unbelievable. Like like is a little out there at times, uh, but entertaining, funny, inside jokes, just like you remember. So. Uh, go watch the movie, go check it out, and uh, it's not kid-friendly. I wouldn't take kids to it, just, just being real. Probably not. But my favorite part is, is, is they hit this guy with a rubber bullet, and he had this big old welt on his head, and Martin's like, I got it, I got it, it's calling me, it's calling me. And he, and he pokes it. Anyways, sorry, I'm just not ruining the movie, it's just that's, that was the best. Like, I was dying. It had me. Mike. Spoiler alert. Yeah, spoiler alert. All right. Mr. Clay, you want to add anything? <laughs> yeah, all right. All right, sweet. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I would so I'd give it an 8. eight. I thought it was good. I thought it brought back a lot of the, the, dy the dynamics they were talking about. They're big pair. They played well with each other. They still got it. 25 years later. They still got it. I thought it was 30. Nice. All right. 
Well, thanks for checking in. Next month will be the Harley Quinn movie. We live together. We die together. Bad boys for life. They didn't get the memo. All right, guys. Have a good one.